In this tutorial, we're going to look at the wait time action. This can be useful when, for example, you've changed the state of a signal and are waiting for a grip as close. To wait by time, we come up to the procedure tab and select wait. We can set an alias, but the only thing required here is the duration. I'm going to say I want to wait for two seconds. I can also change that to any other time unit that I want. And I'm going to assign that into my merge to be combined with my other actions. Once that's done, I can solve my procedure. We can see that there's a wait now in my procedure browser. And when we simulate, we see that the robot does actually wait in simulation. 